It's time to compromise. The city council wrestles for seven more hours on medical marijuana. We're getting closer to a new ordinance, but as John Schwatter reports, there are still several unresolved issues. L.A. City lawmakers Tuesday agreed to slash the number of medical marijuana clinics to somewhere between 70 and 200, a far cry from the estimated 800 now operating in Los Angeles. Also approved that some patients in a medical marijuana collective could make cash payments to acquire their pot, a move applauded by medical marijuana activists. The lengthy debate full of surprises, like this one. Can you smoke marijuana walking down the streets of Los Angeles? Turns out there are very few limits on where you can smoke medical marijuana. And now the council wants to look at imposing more. The council also signaled it wants the collectives to be non-profits and doesn't want their managers to get rich. Nobody should make more than $100,000 a year. Others disagreed. I'm going to vote no on this one because it's just not any of our business. Others argued that unless collectives were required to grow their own marijuana here in Los Angeles, they'd get their pot from Mexican drug lords or the like. It's going to be very easy for these collectives to get marijuana from the black market. To make sure bad guys weren't involved, others simply suggested, why not just have the city control the marijuana growing facilities? And that's something I think will complete the picture in trying to control the source of this. The council will iron out the final details next week. In Los Angeles, I'm John Schwatter, Fox 11 News.